My name's Connie Deletti. I'm 32 and very healthy. I never gave the subject of death any thought. Well, until recently. Do you want to live longer or do you want to die later? And with that, I had a brand new obsession. So I'm starting to think about death now. Do you think about it, Nona? Every day. Are you afraid to die? No, never afraid to die. And I started to wonder, what will I do with my body after I die? So I set off on a trip across North America, checking out some of the most amazing options we all have for our bodies once we die. Should my ashes be turned into a diamond? Once that lid is closed, four days later, we can have our two carat finished diamond. Or maybe a piece of glass art. We'll make art out of dead people. Could my remains be photographed? To me, what is so wonderful is what is under the skin. Or used to help underwater sea life. I'd much rather be in the ocean with all that life and action going on around me than in a field with a bunch of old dead people. I could even be blasted into outer space. We fly people to Earth orbit, to the moon, to deep space. Or be frozen for eternity. Cryonics involves freezing somebody in the hope that someday they can be revived. I believe in it 100%. There's nothing in the Bible that says thou shalt not freeze. From mummification to plastination, I want to know all the options I have for my body once I die. Anyone can choose mummification, provided that they're looking at it as a continuation of their existence once they die. These are real human brain. You can see this one here has a spinal cord. Would you choose to do this with your body? I don't know. <laughs> Join me on this journey as I try to overcome my fear of death and ultimately make a decision. We have one life, one body. What will you do with yours? Once we shake off this mortal coil and Hamlet's immortal words, you know, we'll find out. Awesome. <laughs>